Hello Internet, WearNotice here and the computer accessory company Logitech just announced a new MX Master mouse called the MX Master 2S. Now before we get into the details of this new MX Master mouse, I'd just like to say how excited I was when I heard Logitech had announced a new MX Master mouse because I've been using this beautiful MX Master right here. This is now the old one and I love it. It's absolutely fantastic. So yeah, I just wanted to say I was very excited when I saw this news because this is a great mouse in my opinion. Okay, now with that out of the way, let's talk about what's new in the MX Master 2S. Visually, the new mouse looks almost identical to its predecessor. The only noticeable differences are that the 2S has a shorter Logitech logo and a slightly different color scheme. It comes in graphite instead of black, midnight teal instead of navy blue, and light gray instead of stone. In other words, the MX Master 2S is aesthetically pretty much the same as the old MX Master. But don't worry, Logitech isn't asking you to buy another mouse that costs about $100 without at least giving it one real new feature, which the company calls Logitech Flow. Flow allows the MX Master 2S to control at most three computers at once with the ability to copy and paste between these computers. To make it even better, this works even if the computers aren't running the same operating system. Now, this whole copy and paste between Windows and Mac thing sounds like a pretty cool and helpful new feature. I can say that from experience since Apple devices can already copy and paste things between each other and I frequently copy things on my Mac and paste on my iPhone and vice versa. However, it is worth noting that excluding the copy and paste capability, the Logitech Flow feature of the MX Master 2S was kind of already in its predecessor. Although you couldn't fluidly move the mouse's cursor from screen to screen on the MX Master like you can on the new 2S, the MX Master did have a button to quickly switch between up to three computers over Bluetooth. But the MX Master 2S does have a few other new features under the hood, such as its maximum of 70 days of battery instead of the MX Master's 40 days, in addition to a new tracking sensor that goes up to 4000 DPI instead of its predecessors up to 1600 DPI tracking sensor. And that's pretty much it for the MX Master 2S's new features. It doesn't seem like a hugely different, groundbreaking new mouse. It seems more like an incremental update, which one could guess from its name, 2S, which ends in S just like the more incrementally updated iPhones. So that'll be all for this wear notice video about the Logitech MX Master 2S. And if anyone from Logitech is watching this video and wants to hook me up with a Logitech MX Master 2S to unbox and review, head to this page on the wear notice website and we can let the wonderful wear noticers get up close and personal with your new mouse. Wear noticers, feel free to watch my unboxing video of the 2S's predecessor, this Logitech MX Master right here, and also feel free to subscribe to the Wear Notice YouTube channel for more awesome technology videos. It would make me very, very happy if you'd subscribe, and I do love all my subscribers, so if you want my love, you know what to do. Hit that subscribe button, and I'll love you. Wear Notice, out.